Welcome back. You know, we've been covering USA Cycling all week. It's continuing through the weekend. It's a big weekend. But right now we have cyclist Kendall Ryan and Luke Lamperti. They're both from California, both here to answer questions about what it's like from the athlete's perspective. Okay, you started racing when you were six, right? Yes. What about you? Uh, I was 10. 10, so yeah. young, yeah, yeah. so young. So tell us um, what kind of training you started with. I mean, when did you know you'd love this? Uh, for me, it's probably when I was uh, 15. I started traveling internationally, wow. um, getting to race with uh, the U.S. national team overseas a bunch. And yeah, I was like, this is what I want to do. I want to travel. I want to race. Um, yeah, and it was a family thing, and my sister races on the same team as me. So oh, that's cool. um, yeah, it's pretty special. What about you? Yeah, for me, I think I just love the competitive aspect of it. I actually grew up racing motocross and then switched to bicycles, and I think. It's just being competitive and racing, and then quite similar, actually, I ended up uh, going to Europe my first time at 15, and that's yeah, that's exciting. when I fell in love. What do you do to prepare? I know oh. there's a long <laughs> list, but we're going to talk coming up tomorrow about calories consumed, calories spent, all the things with nutrition, but mentally, what do you do to focus on the different courses that you face? when you go to these different races. Yeah, I think the long and the short is you just spend a lot of hours on a bicycle, but um, yeah. yeah, mentally it's quite a tough sport, so you definitely prepare in that aspect for a lot of different races, but at the same time, the training goes towards every race. Let's talk about Sherrod Hill, the big hill. <laughs> it's what, two minutes, something like that? I mean, do you put that in your head, like, okay, I can do anything for two minutes? What, how do you? Uh, I Get mean, I'm not, a, I'm not a climber, so <laughs> I struggle with that hill for sure, so I'm definitely dreading every time we have to go up it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, you just kind of have to take it in chunks and, and just get around each bend and focus on the next and try to stay in contact with the group. So um, that's my tactic. I try to start at the front and sift through the back. <laughs> there you go. Well, you know, we've got so many people cheering you on. How does that help? Does that make a difference? Yeah, it helps a lot to have everyone there on Sherrod Hill and all the locals come out. definitely makes a big difference when other people are watching and help and motivate. That's wonderful. What do you think about the course here in, in Knoxville? You're coming from a completely different area. Yeah, um, I mean, we've done, I think, very, the same course um, the last seven years. So uh, yeah. we're, we all know the sweet spots on it, where it's a good spot to attack. Um, so, yeah, it's, but it's different every year, different outcomes every year. So, um, yeah, just excited to, to be here and give it a go. We're glad you're here. Now, I've got to let you go with this. I, I have to ask, the rain. What do you think about when it rains and how do you handle that? Do you, do you accept it and go on with it or do you think, oh, no, here we go? Yeah, I think you race rain or shine, and everyone has to deal with the rain. So, yeah, it's not ideal, and the road gets slippery. But other than that, you just race either way. What about you? Yeah, um, I like racing in the rain, and I, I think uh, it really shows the people that have really good skills and have prepared and know their tire pressure that they need to run. And, um, yeah, the people that are not scared uh, really do usually well. So, okay, yeah. I like that. I like that mentality. Thank you both. Good luck to both of you. You're reigning champions. We really appreciate all you do, and we admire it. Thank and, you so uh, much. Welcome to town. Thank, Thank you for having us. We'll be watching. <laughs>